Hello my beautiful people, it's Katie and welcome back to another YouTube video. Today we're doing another massive closet clean out because I'm moving out for real this time. So if you didn't watch my last video, I went apartment hunting in Florida because I found an apartment to live in in Florida and I will be moving in the next month. So I'm going through the entire process of cleaning out my room, packing up my room and getting ready to move to a new state. And that means going through all my clothes because I have a lot of them and a lot of them I don't wear. Every time I do a closet clean out video there's some pieces that I keep and I'm like we'll see if I wear this if not then I'll get rid of it and that's what we're gonna be doing today all the stuff that I'm not gonna be keeping is gonna be going to the Goodwill or sold on my Depop my Depop is just Katie McKenzie I sell everything for a really affordable price over there so if you want to buy anything you're gonna be on there but let's get started because there's a lot to go through we're gonna be starting with this closet everybody knows this closet it's always a mess the mess is this closet there is a lot of pieces hanging up here that I just do not wear and I don't know why I've kept them for so long so I feel like now is the time to actually get rid of them because I kept telling myself I'll wear them and I literally never reach for anything so we gotta actually go through it. Let's get it started. Okay. My dad finally took out the little like chair piece of our couch that was here so I can open my closet door. Do, 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 do. Like, I'm sorry, this shirt is cute, but it's just not my style. I think I wore it one time, so this is gonna be sold on my Depop. I like this shirt, it's cute, but again, like, I would never wear it now. I don't wear stripes, really. Not a stripe girl. Again, with the stripes. This was one of my work uniform jackets from the golf place that I used to work at. So many people used to ask me where I got these. They're from work, but I'm literally never gonna wear that ever again, so. No, so many empty hangers. This cropped little Nike tee, really cute, but again, not really my style, so. Depop, ow, can't even reach the back of this closet. Ow, my arms hurt, okay. This is this old FSU shirt. Cute, but getting donated, not my style. I have too many clothes, way too many clothes. I have had this Princess Polly dress for probably like three or four years now, and it literally still has the tags on it. I've never worn it, it's so cute, but it was just too big on me. But like, look how cute this is. Flowy at the bottom. The only thing is, it has a little minor like tear in it. Can you see this? Like right there, it's so little. You could easily stitch it up, but I think I'm gonna try and sell it on my Depop because it's so nice. And so cute. I don't know. I've literally never worn it. I feel like I just didn't get rid of anything. I bought this cute little romper. It just fits weird. It's pink. It'd be so cute for the beach, but again, I just don't like the way it fits. So, okay, I definitely can get rid of more. Why am I being so stingy? I've worn this green shirt one time, but I really like it. I think it's so cute. Is this my style? I have the hardest time getting rid and buying clothes because I don't know what my style is. Like I just wear what I think is kind of cute, what I think is comfy, what's trending. So I'm always buying new clothes because I don't know what I like to wear. I feel like I don't have an identity. <laughs> Ugh. And then like some of the stuff I need to keep because it's gonna be cold some places I go to. Like just because I'm moving to Florida doesn't mean I'm gonna be warm all the time, right? I feel like I did not get rid of enough. I'm feeling stressed, I'm feeling very stressed. This is like nothing. This is literally like nothing. Why did I get rid of nothing? Ah! Go crazy. Yo, what do I do? I mean, I have gotten rid of a lot of other clothes. Like, let me show you guys this. Under my bed. <laughs> Let me reach it all. These are the clothes that are actively listed on my Depop right now. So it's not like I haven't gotten rid of some things already. And I have shipped out a few Depop orders already. So yeah, there's definitely this. But I feel like that was not a lot of progress made. But okay, I'm just going to count it because it's something. This is the pile of need to be listed on Depop. This is the already listed on Depop that's going underneath my bed. Remember, just going to go like that so no one can see it anymore. Y'all see this mess? Yeah, that's the mess of tiny tops, workout shorts and leggings and sports bras. And then there's swimsuits back there, bikinis. I've been trying to go through those for the past like three days and I've made a little bit of progress, but I really don't see myself getting rid of too many of those because that's like a majority of my clothes that I wear, especially since I'm gonna be at the beach. So I know it doesn't look very organized, but I, <laughs> I think it's okay. We're gonna be done with this closet for a little while and we're gonna go outside. Oh, look at my face. The lighting in here is not good right now. We're gonna go to my outside closet and go do with all the hoodies and sweatshirts and sweatpants. Okay, the lighting in this hallway is not good, but look at this mess. Yeah, not my best work. I wear the same five sweatshirts. For some reason, I have like this emotional attachment to sweatshirts, 
hoodies, sweats, like anything comfy and oversized. I feel like it all has a story and there's all a reason why I bought it or got it or anything. So this is really hard for me. But again, I'm gonna be at the beach. Don't need all of these. And it's time to go through them, it really is. We're gonna do it like this. Oh, look at my cute little prom dress. Love her. So here's my merch. I have to keep my merch because it's just like iconic. Here is David Dobrik's merch. He actually liked my Instagram picture a few years ago when I wore this, but haven't worn it in a few years. So that's getting donated. Anger goes back. Also my merch, this sweatshirt is so cute. Oh, Cape Sandblast hoodie. Maybe we'll keep that. <laughs> I love this sweatshirt, but I have it in an XL and I don't ever wear this medium one. So this will be sold on my Depop. I love these sweats. They have like matching sweatpants too. And I live in this all the time. This is my uncle's restaurant. So we're keeping that one. Trippy red sweatshirt. Gotta keep that. Post Malone. I love this sweatshirt, but I haven't worn it in so long. And it's old and it's pilling. This was his Hollywood's bleeding tour. Mm. Okay, donate. This hurts. This hurts so bad. What size is this? See, the other thing about sweatshirts is that if they're like not an XL, I like don't want to wear them because I want them to be so large like this is cute, but we're gonna get rid of it Ah, I'm stressing. Wait, but should I? That's adorable and it's so beachy. No, I'm keeping it. Okay, but here's my issue I literally have like the same one right here Okay, we're just gonna get rid of this one because the colors look a little lighter on this one Which is fine, but I think I like the other one more. Hmm. This one's cute. We're definitely keeping her. Oh, I'm such a fake. Okay, this is my old cheer sweatshirt. Sunday fun day. I feel like my mom would wear this. We'll give this one to my mom. She would love this. Okay, here's the messy part because these are all the sweatshirts that I wear and don't feel like hanging back up. So I made a lot of progress up there, but now we gotta deal with all this. Can y'all tell I really don't like doing this? I don't think you can. Okay, so I have these little drawers in here that are filled with clothes that I literally didn't even know existed. Oh my gosh, I've been looking for these PJ pants. Keeping these, duh. These sweats, I love. Keeping those. See, like, I didn't even know these existed. These are like parachute pants. Gotta try those on. These are cute orange pants. I wore them once. I think these are beachy too, so we're gonna try them on, see if they still fit. Keep them if they do. Getting rid of this Vans little crew neck. Super cute, just don't wear it that much. Also, this like Sherpa jacket, also super cute. Also, don't wear it that much. Oh, I love this one. Gotta keep them. See, I used to always buy like my favorite YouTubers merch, and this was Seek Discomfort merch. One of my favorite YouTubers that I used to watch all the time, but I'm gonna sell this one as well because it's such good quality. I like never wore it. Let's speed around through some of this because I don't feel like talking anymore. <laughs> this Fila jacket. I literally have never worn this before and it's so cute. Oh my gosh, y'all. This pile is getting huge. Making progress. Let's go. I said I wasn't gonna talk and here I am. <laughs> This is the pile of ones that I'm keeping. This is an issue. Aw, oh, this one's so cute, but I never wear it. This is from Pizza Slime, which is like the people that make the stop looking at my sweatpants. It's so cute, but I also like never wear her. It literally just has like all these pizzas on it. <laughs> pizza Hut, Papa John's, Little Caesars, Domino's, Chuck E. Cheese. My favorite pizza is Little Caesars. Unpopular opinion, but I think it's the best. My friend literally is obsessed with Domino's and Papa John's and I don't like those as much. I think Little C Caesars is the best. So I actually might give this one to my friend because he is obsessed with pizza. Literally eats it for every meal. This is exhausting. Almost done, Katie. Focus, focus, focus. Aw, look at my Auburn sweatshirt. Reminds me of Bella. And then we have Bama. I literally have a sweatshirt from like every college ever. What's this one? Go Steelers. Oh. Jesus, 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 Jesus. This looks like I'm a hoarder. Another like super cute Gymshark one, size medium. I love, I'm keeping size XL ones, but I'm gonna sell that one. Okay, I think honestly, I'm gonna keep all the rest of these. I know it looks like a lot, but I wear all of them. Like that's the problem. Actually, I can get rid of this zip up. It's a little jank, but some of these are just sentimental. Like this is my cheer jacket. I don't wanna get rid of any of them. I got rid of a lot, so progress is progress. Okay, I know it's not the cleanest ever, but that is so much progress. This is the pile that's going to be sold and donated. And these are things I need to try on, so success. Y'all ready for this? This is, dang it. This is like one of the most satisfying sounds to me. I don't know why. I'm gonna put the stuff I listed on Depop already in the bottom, cause that makes more sense, right? Cause I have to list these things. Yeah, that's genius. Sometimes I'm so genius. Back under the bed. <laughs> Some of this is 
definitely gonna have to go in the other bag because this trash bag is already full. Goodness gracious, Katie McKenzie. What is wrong with me? We're gonna walk out that door. I have to tell you something. It's gonna make probably some people sad, but if you don't know, I love country music. I just saw Carrie Underwood in concert. I just saw Thomas Rhett last year. And I got tickets to go see Zach Brian in concert, who I love. I've been listening to Zach Bryan for years, so I'm so excited. Here we go. There's two bags of clothes already. Yay! I have to tackle this monster, but everybody knows that these drawers are broken. Wow. <laughs> the drawer is broken! Um, I don't think that's supposed to look like that. I really don't want to. <laughs> but honestly, I don't think there's too much in here that I'm gonna get rid of because I got rid of so much last time. And two bags already is pretty freaking good, but there's definitely some things. I think in this drawer. Oh, see, it won't even open. Okay, let's start. <laughs> This lighting stinks right now. I'm like, have lines all over me. I look like a little zebra. So, ew, don't look at my toes! I actually just bought so many new pairs of jeans, and I know, you guys know, if you were an OG, I used to never wear jeans. I still don't really like wearing jeans, but there's so many occasions in my life now that I'm 19 years old that you can't just wear leggings and have it be appropriate, so you have to wear jeans. I needed some ones that fit, so I actually just bought these. These are really cute. I buy a lot of my pants from Addicted. This isn't sponsored, but I really, really love their stuff. Like, it's pretty affordable. The shipping is super fast, so I really like Addicted. Both of these pants are from there. So yeah, definitely check out their jeans. I actually might have a coupon code. Again, this isn't sponsored, but if I do, I'll put it down below so you guys can use it. I also have like the infamous leather pants from there. They're like flare leather pants, they're fake leather, but if you need going out pants, these are the ones. So flattering. And they're only like 50 bucks, which is pretty freaking cheap, I think. So I'm definitely keeping these because I need them. Okay, these need to just go in the trash. They're white sweatpants and I love them, but they're so stained. I just can't do it anymore. I don't know how I feel about these jeans. I've worn them twice recently, but they're just so big. They're really cute, but they're really big. But I I like them. Also, this part gives me like a diaper, kind of. I think I'm gonna keep them for now. Again, one of the things I need to come back to. Plus, it's always good to have jeans. I also have these. Dang, I have a lot more jeans than I thought. I haven't worn these in a while. These are black jeans. These are from Urban. These are like $100, so definitely not getting rid of those. Oh, these have no holes in them. These are my church jeans. I actually have so many more pairs of jeans than I thought, but I only wear like three or four of them like going out. Oh, these are the Gymshark sweats I was talking about. Why is there a pair of underwear in my pants drawer? Okay, these also need to go to the trash. I love them. This is so TMI, but I accidentally bled through them so bad and there's like the huge stain, so nope. This skirt, super cute. I've worn it too many times. This is definitely getting sold, but it's from Princess Polly and I love it. Oh, this one is also so cute from Princess Polly. Never worn, still has a tag on it getting sold this i'm not a skirt girl i've tried this one's cute maybe i'll keep that one shorts i don't know why they're in that drawer pj pants i have so many pj pants i love them also shorts goodness katie i'm a mess a mess i tell you i have to sneeze Bless me. I feel like I'm keeping a lot in this drawer, but I actually wear them a lot. It has like sweats, PJ pants, that kind of thing. So yeah, we're gonna keep a lot. I think I'm just gonna get rid of those skirts, but those skirts are actually so cute. Like whoever gets them, they're both from Princess Polly. I love both of them. And I've taken pictures of one of them so you can see what it looks like, but that was easy. Now some of my cold lows are folded. He wore some. Like I said, I'm kind of like mini rebuilding my wardrobe. So I ordered a few things on Amazon. No, this isn't sponsored, but yes, everything is linked to my storefront down below. It's on the summer list, everything that I'm showing you. So I got a few new bikinis and I'm really excited about them. I got this purple one, which I think is gonna be so good for like bigger boobied girls. If you don't know, when you have larger boobies, the ones that tie around the neck hurt so bad, but it's cause it's putting all your pressure on your neck and this one doesn't. Like you put your arms through it like this and then it ties in the back. So I'm really excited about this pretty purple color. And then everyone knows I love a cheeky bikini. So yeah, that's the back of that one. If you're not into it, that's okay. If you are, that's also okay. I'm also going to Hawaii in less than a week. I'm just going to visit. You guys know I'm obviously moving to Florida, but I am going to visit and this is gonna be so cute with a tan. Like I'm literally so excited. That's the first one that I got. I have a few more that are coming in. Next we got this blue bikini. It has the cute little underwire and it's like a good ribbed material. This one actually fits my larger oobies. I got them in a size medium by the way, but I loved the color. This is the front. This is the back. This is a little more full coverage. I don't know. To each their own. I like this one. It's really thick quality material. So 
That's why I like it. And I can never find tops with underwire that fit my boobs good, so that was a plus. And then, I'm really excited about these. I got these linen pants. I've always wanted a pair of really cute, like beachy linen pants. And these were like less than 30 bucks. They have this like waistband right here, and they have pockets, they're really flowy, and they fit me, cause I'm 5'8". So they actually touched my ankles, which is like a very big surprise. So love, love, love these linen pants. They're gonna be so cute. Just wait for the pictures. Cannot wait. Lastly, I got these little sunglasses. I only buy cheap sunglasses because I lose or break every single pair, but I think these are cute and beachy. Of course, I got the silver ones. I'm just a silver girly, but do we like? I don't know. I'm still deciding if I like them or not. I feel like the shape might be a little weird on my face, but they have lots of colors if you want to go check them out. This is the only thing I'm iffy about. But yeah, those are the things that I just kind of added to my summer wardrobe. Since I'm getting rid of a lot, I'm also having to replace a lot. You know, cycle through, donate, shop, do some good stuff. But yeah, I think that's the end of this video, guys. Thank you so much for helping me clean out my closet. There's gonna be so many moving videos. Like the tripod that you're set on right now is all the stuff that I ordered for my new apartment. Look at this. I had to buy silverware, y'all. Who buys silverware? A 19 year old buying silverware? Look, here we got some cutting boards. So yeah, there's a lot going on now. Um, I'm having to make a lot of big girl purchases. Lots of new moving videos coming soon. So also I want to say, yes, I officially got the apartment. So we do have officially a place to live. I told you I was in the application process in my last video, but I got approved. But I love you guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below. Don't forget to follow all my socials. They're all Katie McKenzie. Like I said, I'm going to Hawaii very soon for a little trip. So there's gonna be a lot of fun stuff. And then of course, all the moving content, but I love you. Always smile. Don't forget to be kind and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.